Hello, Dr. Ferguson coming to you again from the Passion Camp. We've been having a series on natural hormone therapy and we're going to continue on that. This time we're going to go to the other end of the extreme. We're going to go to the person that may be going into menopause. Last time we were talking about the person that may, have, may be having a painful period. Now the person that's going into menopause, they may be having a hormone imbalance which would give symptoms like hot flashes and night sweats. They could have some irritability too. But the night sweats and the hot flashes are the most common two that happen. And contrary to what was a popular belief in the past, those of us who are into natural hormone therapy now know that it's much more a balance Very much of the, call, Tony. of the estrogen and the progesterone than it is just the estrogen. And the balance is what's important for success in any of the hormone balancing that we're talking about. All of your hormones need to be in sequence with each other. They need to be in harmony with each other. They need to be communicating on a, on a good basis with each other where they're, they're intertwining and they're mixing up in a, in a healthy fashion. And so contrary to what I learned when I was in medical school is that um, if you were having night sweats and uh, hot flashes that that was primarily an estrogen issue. Well, I'm going to tell you now that that's not primarily an estrogen issue, but it's a balance. It's a balance between the amount of estrogen and the amount of progesterone. And if we get those two in balance, then we'll generally be able to get the night sweats and the hot flashes in check. Now, one of the things that happens relatively uh, easy sometimes, and that's getting the night sweats in check. And that, if we treat the person with progesterone cream, many times we get the night sweats in check. Now, they may take a little more to it to that than, than get the hot flashes in check. But the night sweats just by themselves, if that's the biggest and if that's the only issue, then many times with progesterone uh, cream, we're able to get that in check. Now, the same thing happens when men have prostate cancer and they have an imbalance. And many times they will have night sweats too just like the women have, and they also get night sweats and hot flashes. They get both of those sometimes when they're having an issue with prostate cancer. And sometimes that can also be corrected with progesterone cream. So there, as you can see that there are lots of different uh, things that are happening in your body that are hormone related. And many times they can be corrected by just bringing a balance between the estrogen, the testosterone, the progesterone, the DHA, the cortisol, if we can bring a balance to those things, then many times we can bring those symptoms under control. So on that note, I'll catch you next time. Dr. Ferguson coming to you from the Passion Camp. All right. Bye-bye.